Today, we're diving into two awesome 3D design tools, Spline and Vectory. Let's break them down and see which one's best for your needs. First up, we have Spline. It's a browser-based tool focused on creating 2D and 3D web designs with an intuitive interface you can craft interactive 3D visuals, animations, and textures using AI prompts. It's perfect for web developers and designers who want to embed 3D elements into sites with simple code snippets. Spline shines for real-time collaboration and integrates with platforms like Webflow, but it supports limited file formats for imports, which can be a drawback. Next, we have Vectory. Also browser-based, Vectory is a user-friendly 3D modeling platform with a focus on collaboration and augmented reality. It supports over 60 file formats, including CAD, making it super versatile. Vectory offers a rich library of templates, photorealistic rendering, and web AR features for immersive experiences. It's great for beginners and pros alike, but complex models might lag on lower end hardware. So how do they stack up? Spline is ideal for web designers needing quick, interactive 3D assets for websites. Its UI is sleek, but it's less flexible with file imports. Vectory, on the other hand, is a powerhouse for diverse 3D projects from AR to 3D printing with broader file formats and collaboration tools. However, it may require a stronger internet connection for smooth performance. Here's a quick chart to sum it up. If you're a web designer focused on seamless 3D web integration, go with Spline. For versatile 3D modeling, AR, or CAD project, Vectory is your pick. Both are awesome, so try their free versions to see what fits. That's it guys, which tools are you trying first? Let us know below and don't forget to like, subscribe for more tech tips. See you in the next video.